everyone, welcome back to Yellow Cottage Soapery. I am making a soap called Butterfly Flower, and this is a dupe of a Bath and Body Works fragrance. And I made it one time um, before I started making videos, and I made it in a long kind of slab mold, and I piped freehand a butterfly, a huge butterfly on it. And it was so pretty, and then I had to cut it, and of course, you can't tell when you cut it that it's, you know, a piece of a butterfly. So I decided this time I was going to just put these little butterfly embeds on the top. Um, I found this mold at Michael's. They have a whole bunch of new um, cute molds there. Silicone molds. So um, I'm going to put the butterflies on the top. And I decided to kind of do an ombre. But I'm going to do it with pink. Um, kind of graduating into purple and then into blue and I'm gonna have um, just a tiny bit of white for the top just to kind of add some color so I can or add some um, so the butterflies will show up better basically so I'm gonna be adding one color into another color to try to make it so it flows more in the soap I don't know if it, how it's gonna work but I'm going to try, and this is the fragrance description. This is a really nice fragrance. When I used it before, I had a lot of time to pipe. I don't remember it rising or any um, acceleration, really. So that's why I bought it again. It's really nice. It says, fresh ozone notes that lead to this lighthearted green floral bouquet. A blend of lily and sage is twisted with shimmering greens as tangy tones of cassis create a bright accent for the floral sea. Sweet amber and crisp orange flower are blended with musk at the base of the scent. And I have this lotion from Bath & Body Works that somebody had given me and um, I compared it and it does smell just like it. So if you're a fan of that fragrance, this is really good. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. these three to be kind of even, so... Let's see... A bit more... And then I will do this for... This will be the white. to show you my inspiration picture for the butterfly. Let me show you real fast. I just googled butterflies and I really liked this one that had the pink, purple, and blue. So that was kind of my inspiration, but I'm not using black in it. And I spilled most of this titanium dioxide earlier when I was piping cupcakes and it was a mess. out of purple. This is Magic Purple from Be Scented. And I'm so sad it's gone. And I'm almost out of Voodoo, so I'm actually going to mix. Um, this is what I use to make the butterflies. So I'm just going to put a little of that in there, and I'm going to do a little bit of this brighter pink. Let's 
see how that looks. And then this one will be the blue. And this is um, Cosmic Blue Neon from Nurture Soap. It's part of their Carnival collection. So let me see.
to cut butterfly flower and it's the side so I think it's going to be hopefully a really cool um, gradient ombre look to it Love this fragrance. Last one. Okay, guys, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you on the next video.